Ga Gopuro Lama Gopuro Kucha Ga Tuba Muse Gopura Wenziji Ezeko Mera Wari Omoga Gopura Yesu Wenuga Yes, and I'm still in a, where I only start from. Okay, praise the Lord. Amen. No. Okay, but before we go to go. Okay. Amen. Amen. So, um, I want you to give me. No. Okay, first read for me. Chapter 4, verse 18. 19. Okay, read for me. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me. Mm. Because He has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. Yes. He has sent me to heal the broken hearted. Yes. To proclaim liberty to the captives mm. and recovery of sight to the blind. Okay. To set at liberty those who are oppressed. Okay. To proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord. Yes. Then he closed the book and then and I, I need those words to be here. Is it okay she gets a good number? Okay. Mm -hmm. Then he closed the book. Yeah, I'm not here Then he closed the book mm -hmm. and gave it back to the attendant and sat down. Yes. And the eyes of all who were in the synagogue were fixed on him. Uh -huh. the the oh, no, no, no. Continue. 22. And he began to say to them, uh -huh. Today this scripture is fulfilled in your hearing. The God. The God. Omoyo kwa mukama kuli kunze kubanga yakukako amafuta okuhulira abavu ebigambo ebirungi antume okutendera abanyage okutekwa no kuzibula abazibe ba maso okubata abale tentekwa okutendera omwaka kwa mukama ogwakirisibwa yes nyabika ko ekitabo nachikiza omuweleza natula abantu bonna abali mukunganiro yes Nima musiba ko amaso Natanula okuba gambanti Leo, ilia wanikuwa bino Bito kilite mumatuka mwe So, we We, I remember I touched that part Zipikila na kwa ta kuchitua mwecho Ok, can you give it to me in English? Chipe kwa mwereza And he began to say to them Today, this scripture Is fulfilled in your hear Ok now, Akati, I want you to underline the word scripture. This word here. Today this scripture. Okay? And then I want to ask you a question. Is this singular or plural? It is singular. Mark that word, right? Now give me 2 Timothy chapter 3 verse 15. I want to show you something more. I have like two sessions to cover, but the spirit will help me. Okay, read for me. And that from childhood, yes. you have known the Holy Scriptures. And that from what? Childhood. You have known the what? The Holy Scriptures. Which are? Able to make you wise for huh? salvation. Through? Through faith which is in Christ Jesus. Now, look at that. That is. You see that Paul is using holy what? Scriptures. So why is power using scriptures? Right power because it's a pure one in Kibwa. Okay? So also underline that one. Give me John 5.39. You can't understand that. 
You see, I want you to pay attention. Eh? Yeah, can I say those? Mark that as well. You search the scriptures. You search the what? The scriptures. Also underline that word. Yeah, it is is this singular or plural? Scriptures mean, right? Underline that word as well. Okay? Also give me Luke 24-25. Mm-hmm. We want to see why Jesus said today this scripture. But in most of other times we see the Bible saying scriptures. That's what you want to understand. Then he said to them, uh-huh. O foolish ones, mm. and slow of heart to believe in all that the prophets have spoken. Continue. Or to know the Christ mm. to have suffered these things. And to enter into his glory. Uh-huh. And beginning at Moses. Uh, slowly, go slowly there. Yeah. And beginning at Moses. Uh-huh. And all the prophets. Uh-huh. He expounded to them in all the scriptures. The right. things concerning himself. You see? In all the what? The scriptures. Now, we notice that. So, what is the difference between a scripture and scripture? Okay. Now, according to Jesus, yes. scriptures, yeah? scriptures, yeah. He, he tells us what they are. He really tells us what they are. Mm-hmm. Now, what he quoted mm-hmm. was a scripture, mm-hmm. and that is Isaiah 61. Mm-hmm. Right? But let us first continue. Mm-hmm. Go to 44 and 45. Mm-hmm. Look. Then he said to them, mm. These are the ones which I spoke to you mm. while I was still with you, mm. that all things must be fulfilled which were written in the law of Moses uh-huh. and the prophets and the Psalms concerning me. Do you see? Can you say that again? Then he said to them, mm. These are the ones which I spoke to you while I was still with you, mm. that all things must be fulfilled. Which were written in the law of Moses. Uh-huh. So he, he talks about the law of what? Are you going to take a young Musa? And then what? And yeah. the prophets. Then he talks about the prophets. And then the what? And the Psalms. And then the Psalms. Exactly. Now, this thing is to me. It's what it is as called scriptures. Yes, I tell you one day. Now for him he categorizes them, he breaks them down. Now, when you say the law of Moses, we have already told you that they are the first five books of the Bible. Remember that? The first what? Of the Bible. You see that? And we all know them. From Genesis, Exodus, uh-huh. Huh? Yeah. Leviticus, yeah. 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 Numbers, and what? Yeah. And Deuteronomy. Yeah. You see that? Good. Then, the prophets. Okay. So, and we told you, yeah. the prophets here, we classify them into two. There are prophets who wrote bigger volumes. And there are prophets who wrote smaller volumes. You get to me? Yeah. Yes. And now, those who wrote bigger ones. Okay? Mm-hmm. We told you we call them bigger prophets. Just not to confuse you. Maybe in a sense that. Their books were big. Their volumes were very big. Huh? You are getting me? Yeah. Don't, don't, don't. Leave it where it was. Okay? So, uh, now, these are prophets. So we have major. And then we have minor. Yeah? Major prophets, minor prophets. Now, now these ones, they are men, Banchi. Okay? But for specificity, give me an example. Hmm? Can you give me examples of the major prophets? Uh-huh. Jeremiah, uh-huh. Ezekiel, Ezekiel, uh-huh. Isaiah, Isaiah, what else? Huh? Eh? Zachariah, Zachariah. 
I get all these lists. Okay? Then the minor ones, all the small prophetic books you know. They are very many. They are all under here. And the sound. Okay? Can you give me examples of the sound? I'm not telling you. Huh? What? <laughs> the sound. The sounds of David and Sabuli are doubting. Sounds of Moses, that's good. That's good. Then? Yes, that's very good. And then? Yes. Those are some. It's a Sabuli. Full stop. Full stop. Now, that is how Jesus looked at. Now, why he calls them scriptures? It's because. Here we have five books. Here there are many. Of course, you see the Psalms are also divided. No? They have major departments. There is, there is a first division, second division, third division, fourth division, fifth division. Other people think they go up to ten. It depends on who, who is leading you to study them. You see that? Now, that is how Jesus looked at scripture. Amen. Amen. Now, equally, even the apostles, that is how they looked at the scripture. The Pharisees never looked at scriptures that way. No. There was a difference between Pharisee view of scriptures and then, of course, the apostolic view of scriptures. Why do we take? the apostolic view. Because we believe in the God they believe in. Their Savior is our Savior. So Jesus is way of looking at scripture. Automatically without argument becomes ours. In every Bible study the apostles conducted. This was the first lesson. And all believers do that. I can give examples. 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 I can when they had passed through Apophilus and Apol Apollonia, uh -huh. they came to Thessalonica, uh -huh. where there was a synagogue of the Jews. Uh -huh. Then Paul, as his custom was, uh -huh. say that again, you know, you know, say that again. Say say, that again. Then Paul, as his custom was, then Paul, as his custom was, uh -huh. went into them. Went into them. And for three Sabbaths, for three Sabbaths, reasoned with them, underline the word reason. Huh? And for three what? Sabbaths, reasoned with them from the, from the scripture. Can you say that again? The word to me. Then Paul, as his custom was, uh -huh. went into them. Uh -huh. And for three Sabbaths, how many Sabbaths? Sabbath three Sabbaths. Three. Uh -huh. Reasoned with them. Now, what do you want to underline that one? That, that there was mental power there. Now, why? So listen. Human beings can reason. If you have a human mind. Okay. But remember when you are born again. The Bible says, who has known the mind of the Lord that may instruct you? But we have the mind of Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, when you are born again, you have the mind of who? You have the mind of who? You have the mind of who? So you are using Christ this mind to reason carnal minds. I want you to understand what Paul was going through. He was not using a scholastic mind. Please, there is, there is what you call Bible scholars. There, there is mental 
energy. But there is also apostolic approach of the Bible when the Holy Spirit carries you. Eh? And then you start to address the scriptures by the power of the Holy Spirit. Of course, Jesus is the foundation. Now I want you to understand. He was what? Reasoning with him. Now, underline that one. Let me show you more what reasoning means. So he was reasoning with them from the scripture. What does he mean by that? Give me uh, first, uh, I want you to give me Second Corinthians. Mark every scripture I've given you. I will come back to them. I will not remind you, right? Second Corinthians chapter 10. What are we examining? Reasoning. Wakana. Oh, is it reasoning of Ah, so for the So for the yota yota yota. So for the yota yota yota. So for the yota yota Reasoning is the result. Ah, our power on the way of 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 the so the reason is so what the Now go back to him. Yeah. Yeah. So you need to for that reason. Eh? That interpretation. So no, it's not in the Bible. Eh? <laughs> okay, that's good. I'm going to reason. So for this Sabbath, oh, he reasoned with them. Praise the Lord. If he did what? And we want to understand. Which kind of reason? There is, is what you call human reason. And then there is a reason whereby the Spirit of God is used. You are using the mind of the Spirit to reason. That's why I'm taking you to 2 Corinthians chapter 10. And I want you to understand what kind of reason was this. Now, give me it is chapter 10. Okay. Okay. Start from uh maybe verses good here. No really one. Okay, start from verse. Louder. But I beg you that when I am present, I may not be bold with that confidence huh? by which I intend to be bold against some. Uh, oh, oh, you are missing a the point there. Can you say that again? But I beg you. But I beg you. Huh? That when I am present. When I am present. I may not be bold. I may not be bold with that confidence. With that confidence. So there is a confidence that he has. Huh? By which I intend to be bold against some. So when Paul was among believers, Paul was very He could silence a certain boldness. But when he was against some people, that's what the scripture says. When he was against some people, there was a boldness that could awaken within him. And that one is what we call reason. I cannot. I cannot be bold with a believer. But if a snake is sitting in a man, now even if it is attacking the man, there is a boldness that I use. You are getting me? Yeah. Reasoning, we are looking at reason. Can you say that again and continue? But I beg you uh -huh. that when I am present, mm -hmm. I may not be bold with that confidence. By which I intend to be bold against some. Have you seen that? What you have huh? Who think of us? Who think of us? As if we walked according to the flesh. As if we walked according to the what? So now what? Are, what kind of these men are? But these men, they are using the flesh mind. Because they said there was a Okay, to attack men that have a Christocentered mind. I there was a Christo. That is where the battle is. I will tell you. A man is using actually his mind to tamper with the mind of Christ in the Bible. There is a flesh view of what the Bible is all about. But there is a mind of Christ that can be given to a man. That one is not rare. You see, I'm Are you getting what I'm saying? Now. Can you first 
skinny that one in Uganda. So that doesn't appear we are speaking gibberish and Greek and Swahili. I'm going to talk about it. 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 Rendi bao neme okubala ka obuzira obo wendo woza okubana abo Eri abalala abalo woza Nga fekuta ambula okubene nga omubili You see that? Yeah. There are men who read the Bible Walwa batu akasoma Bible But with a carnal perspective When they find men that have a Christ mindset These two minds start to grow You believe Jesus I believe in Jesus But the way you believe Jesus Is it not carnally minded But for me I believe Jesus in a carnal way So the way I approach the Bible It is to score flesh But a man was the mind of Christ. He approaches the Bible in a way to score Christ's goals. So there must be a crash there. Men who use the flesh to approach the scripture. They always think the following number one. That scripture is about to So they gather verses. Uh, run against those who okay, fight against those who fight against run and run and run and Men they are always sleeping. Let the end of the road just them. May they stand upon the stone. May they, may they, may they. After that they feel the men. So they quote verses to mean them. That's what Paul means. When the Paul found men that use the scriptures to mean themselves, this man thinks that the scriptures they are about me. That was a war. They would even solve it. Now he gives us that approach better. Have you found such men? Okay, why did you used to read the Bible? Hey, you have carnal challenges. I know when you are reading the Bible, you find the word in the scripture. Arise and shine. For your light has come. Listen, thank you, Jesus. And you think eh, no, no, no. the person of the scripture is talking about is you. That is the mindset I'm talking about. Yet, the apostles, that man who said arise and shine, is Christ. Christo. In fact, arise and shine means it's a scripture about the resurrection of Christ. Arise means resurrect. Shine, may your light be seen. That scripture is a resurrection scripture. In fact, we quote it when we are teaching resurrection. But we may quote it when we are going through problems. Now, and they quote very many. They quote very many. I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. When I walk through the valley of the shadow of my area, I fear no evil. When I walk through the valley of the shadow of cancer, I fear no evil. When I walk through the valley of the shadow of cancer, I fear no evil. That is a carnal mindset. Hey, you know what I am over here. Who was that David was talking about? My friend, that verse is about to marry you. When Jesus is walking in the valley of the shadow of that day, yes, if he had people, people, he spent many days and many nights in the grave. Rather that verse is about that. It is not about... So and they get offended. No, 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 no. Because that was my supposed to pray. Don't use the scripture to mean you. The scripture they are about one person. Jesus Christ. The 
beauty is that when you read it then and you are seeing Jesus and you find the Jesus when Jesus is found you find yourself in him when Jesus is revealed you are revealed when he is hidden then you are going to fall so that Bible is for one man from Genesis to Malachi so you have to put up the hands eh? oh, the other people they think so that verse is mine they go to the prophets eh? uh, there is a basket here so you write verses and you say put your hand there and then one person gets a verse and then one person gets a verse the nation shall be yours. I'm a wanga can you go? Man of God and better. You see, this is what I've been dreaming. So don't say but they don't say but they do Jesus. Where are they here? Say that Bolimba. Nations are not yours, brother. Nations are for Christ. I'm a wanga but Christ. It is that when he has nations, we rule with the heel. That's why that song says. Yes, I'm not telling you, brother. Why did uh, now uh, you pick up it? <laughs> and behold, I will give you a sign. The boy can only know. The barren shall conceive and bear a son. Oh, I've been barren for many years. Man of God, you are barren. Thank you, Jesus. That's a lie. That barren was made. Not you see that? So when you attack that area again, be ready to be back in fire. You are breaking people's hopes. You are breaking people's lives. You are shattering people's hopes. And you are making Jesus only a matter. That is what that verse Can you read it? Can you read it? Can you read it again? 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 When you are on the main Okubana that you will see that you will When you are on the Okubana that you will see that you will see that you will see this man could open the scriptures as David overcame God. So that is my hero. Jews could use that. Now when you come, God has to sing. God has to teach me. David was great. The only only priest. The anointing is not oil. I'm a footer singer. The anointing is the Holy Spirit. I'm a footer in my own. Jesus is not in the bottle. Yes, that is true. Jesus is the Spirit. Yes, you know. He's not with us. He's not with us. Oh my God. I'm poor to preach like that. Poor to preach. Poor to preach. Jesus. I'm not poor to preach. Poor to preach. Then Jews who could do that. Cities could be shut down because the man has foolish all people's Bible interpretation. The major apostles, the major bishop. You are telling me for seven years I don't know the Bible. Hey, so you want to say I am getting born again today? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Because did you have that interpretation? Now those days have come back. Yeah. 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 Because the Lord is coming back. He's coming back for a church without a spot a ring. And that church is you. So, that is, so if he finds us without spots and ring, so who will he take? So we take him. Will you take care? I don't want to pay off. Hey, Amen. So, can you read again? Verse 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. Now, here's the key in Paulo. Mega Ida, Oro Kakam, Novo Mepua Christo. 
Nze kwe muta woza Nze kwe mu Ha? Ha? Victor Don't, don't stammer <laughs> Don't stammer there Oh man, I'm so tired of waste water. Can you read well? Nenze kenyi ni Paulo beka ilia. Olo buka kam no we no wombe kwa Kristo. Nzo kumuto waza kuimba siri wao. Na ye na ye nze kenyi ni Paulo beka ilia olo buka kam no wombe kwa Kristo. Ze kwe mtu waza Kwe mbasi li wo Biti wa mzira Mbukisha wakati Do you still tell me you grew up in Kalisi? Kakati, how can you fail to read this one? You read this one by the way Ze kwe mtu waza Kwe mtu waza Now kakati ya makata uwa hiya Why don't you hear the pastor? So this one is which one? Mtu waza Mtu waza Mtu waza Mtu waza Oh, 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 is it okay? Oh, what's that? What's that? Oh, 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 what's Continue. Kubate wa kubate nga tutambuli na mumubili. Aha. Tetunu tetunu wa na kukubili na nga mumubili. Can you say that again? Kubate wa kubate nga. First give me English and then you give it to me Luganda. Okay. Yawa kubate. For though we walk in the flesh, we do not walk according to the flesh. Aha. Debra, ah, you have cheated. Can you say it again in English? In English, huh? For though we walk in the flesh, huh? we do not walk according to the flesh. Who doesn't walk in the flesh? When you walk in the flesh, that doesn't mean you fight according to the flesh. You're betting. So what does men do? They quote scriptures and they use them according to the flesh. You're going to see. You're going to see. And by that, they majorly bind the word of God. There is the word of God according to the flesh. And there is the word of God according to the spirit. You see, you see, you see, you know what Jesus meant by that? Why do you disturb us, human? Okay, God, let the Bible help us here. Can you give me the other one? Look at it. Kubani wa kubani inga tu chambuli ya mumubili Aha Tetuluwa na kukubili ya mumubili Tetuluwa na kola ji Kukubili ya mumubili Katika amba uzi So, when you read the scripture Wazo mecha wa nikiwa Eh And you use it to satisfy Na chukwa zeso kukusi Ha The The hunger of the flesh Injana yo mumubili What are you doing? Kukubili ya mumubili Orwana kola ji Kukubili ya mumubili Orwana kola ji Kukubili ya mumubili Oh dear You are using a spirit scripture. Eh? You use its power to score the flesh. Goals. That's what it means. Don't you see that that's a major piece of work? Amen? Yes. Are you here? It's a big one. Can you go ahead? I'm talking about reason. You're going to work on that. Kubanga. Kumanga ilio kuruanisa Kumanga ilio kuruanisa ilio kalo zafi Sibi ya mubili Na hivi ya mani ili katonda Ulo kumenya ili go English 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 Read for me For the weapons of our warfare You see this Mwchira wache For the weapons of our warfare Are not what Sibi ya mubili But Mighty In God For pulling down Strongholds So Our weapons are Okay, the weapons of our faith. And they can't go for their speech. They are moving over there. Have you understood that? You are getting it. 
So what it means eh, don't use spiritual energy to score carnal goals. You use spiritual energy to score spiritual goals. When you find a man is using spiritual power to score carnal goals, eh, that is a spirit of error. It, it is diverting you from the Christ. Praise the Lord. Okay, okay now. Luganda. I want people to really understand this. Kumanga, if you are going to say that 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 you are going to say Now what you do? You break down that and you have to How do you break them? The moment you say the Bible is not about you human being. You've broken something. Uh, the Bible doesn't concern you. The Bible concerns one person. That person is Jesus Christ. And the Bible has one major thing. Salvation. You've so you must be ready for argument. And when the argument comes, how do you silence the argument? By proving that the Bible is about one if you do that, the Holy Spirit will back him up. Do it when you have recorded yourself somewhere. Then when you go back home, sit and look at yourself. You will notice that there was someone who was backing you up. Someone was backing you up. But people were not seeing him. They were backing you up. No, you do that, you see. Gary, you have to make it. 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 Echukulumbaziwa okuluana no kutegera kwa katonda. He has already been talking with this man. You man, I know you are born again. Where are you? But can you say that? I want to say that. Katu menya empaka. Na buli chitu echukulumifu. Echukulumbaziwa okuluana no kutegera kwa katonda. There are things that exalt themselves above the knowledge of God. There is a disobedience that went on. It is not that they are beast Jesus. Let me tell you what it means. If the scriptures say, by his stripes, we are healed. What is because of this? They think that that verse means, by his stripes, I'm healed from poverty. And they stick to that. That's what they believe. That is the when you are turning the By his stripes, we are not healed from poverty. We are not healed from cancer. We are not healed from, from sickness. Uh, by his stripes, we are healed from a broken heart. You to see it's going to be. Do you know what you've done to someone? Can you say that again? So, why do you say that? 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 Why do you that? Why do 
But if we have thoughts of poetry, my prophet told me, I touched you. You who are to tell me, I don't care about the thoughts of poetry. I'm not talking about the thoughts of poetry. I get asked that, what you say? Pass it. Wrong card. I don't get to say it. I don't get to say it. Okuwa la na ekuanga kubuta kuonda bonna. Is that is it? Can you say what does that pass me? Can you say that again? Damo chume na akwete se te se. Aha. Okuwa la na ekuanga. Abakanda wa here. What is okuwa la na ekuanga? It's not easy. No, there is a nation you are coming from. But there is a nation you are living in. If the nation you are in is resisting the other nation. You start to, to revert towards this nation. You are getting me? Mm. Yes, because you are in this world, but you are not of the world. There is a nation you come from. The Christ nation. That's where you come from. Yeah. All of us, if you are Christian, I'm going to go. The Bible says we are a royal priesthood. A chosen. A peculiar what? People. Good. Good. Mira kagete se je se, aha, kuwala na ekuanga, aha, kubota kuonda bonda, aha, kubonda kwa mwe, aha, kukuli tukirida. Go ahead. Gena masu. Mutu nulire evi ntunga webili, aha, kwa mtu ye na, kweye ulira mulinga wa kristo, yero woze chino na te, ye kanti, nga ye wali wa kristo, elana kwewe tutio. Why do there are some people who thought they are more of Christ than others? So when Paul is giving an interpretation that is specifically Christ, he's attacking other people who also believe in Christ. Those men think that we are, we are, we are, we are. That's what you mean. We are also Christians. We believe in Jesus. How can you say? How can you say? But I expect you to have a common language. And your language is someone. That's what I'm talking about. It's there. Uh huh? But you need to be on that way. Don't have a very clear view. Uh huh? Uh huh? What you mean? Eight. Aha, kubanga, never endi suki ila wakwe ni miliza, ha, olohu yiza wafe, ha, mukama wafe kwa yatua, ha, wakuba zima, ha, sosi wakuba sula, nenda, sili kwa ati wansonyi, kenda masu mwenda, neme okufana na anga batisa nebalu wazangi, you see that, continue, ten, Kubanga bo geranti, ebalu wazi nzibu, zamani, na ebo abao, omomili kwa mwenafu, no bo gera kwa siti nitu. Have you seen the bo? Can you say that again? Na mwati sume. Kubanga bo geranti, bo geranti, ebalu wazi nzibu, ebalu wazi nzibu, zamani, zamani. Never about, never about. Omo mi ni pembo na fa. Omo mi ni pembo na fa. No kogo ya pesichi. Kapu mo kapu mo kapu mo kapu mo. Aha. Continue. Yena maso. Continue. Yena maso. Aha. Aliwa aliwa chuo alowose chinoni. Aha. Ngawe tuli mo bigambo. Mo balua ngate tuli yo. Aha. Ena we tu chuo we tuli mo bikorwa ngate tuli eyo. Can you continue? Kubanga, tetuwa nga nga kwelo uoza nga tuli kumuwe ndo kwa balala kubo abate ndeleza boka ne wankubate okwe gira gira nga na bo na ye bo boka nga bege za boka na boka era nga bege gira gira nga boka na boka tebali na magezi Can you say that again? Kubanga tetuwa nganga kwelo uoza nga tuli kumuwendo kwa balala Kubo abete ndeleza boka Ne wakubate kwe gira gira nyana bo Bete ndeleza boka Be gira gira nyana boka Na ye bo boka Nga begeza boka nyaboka Elanga be gira gira nyaboka 
That is where we are talking about. These men, they are using the scriptures to be better than others. So they, they are using the scripture as a weapon to score a kind of God's attack. Okay. So you are using the word to draw companions to the among yourselves. Take our paper and get a yard. 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 By the way, every apostle will do that. But you want to make a Okay? Now, I can't assume that you go reason. But you want to get a street to work on it. Eh? So we go back to the yo. We go back to the yo. Uh huh. Now, uh -huh. when they had passed through Ampophilis yes, and Apollonia, and Apollonia huh? they come to Ma Thessalonica, Thessalonica uh -huh. where there was a synagogue of the Jews. Uh -huh. the then Paul, uh -huh. as his custom was, now not that, that the the Paul had a custom. Paul had a name pizza. Huh? Mm. Uh -huh. Went into them. And for three suppers, huh? reasoned with them from the scripture. Now that's where I was. I, I wanted you to understand what, what, I'm taking. what reasoning is. Okay. Yeah. Eh? Yeah. Not this when you are reasoning for Christ. Okay. When a man says, okay. by his stripes, okay. how is it from God? He said, that's a lie. No, his stripes you just from sin. By his stripes, I have learned. He said, that's a lie. No, by his stripes, eh? mm -hmm. by his stripes, we need to get land. No, we got heavenly citizenship. There you are risen. I will you fight against you are against him with what you are Are you joking? Okay. That, that's why you don't reason. But the best line is like what? Scripture. So they use scripture as a platform. Hey, to use carnal views. Carnal mindsets. Flesh desires. In other words, their target is the scriptures are not only about Christ. They are also about you tell your neighbor. That's a lie. Please, over the No, 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 it is as simple as that. Yes? Uh huh. Continue. You notice he used the scriptures. Uh -huh. Explaining and demonstrating. Explaining and demonstrating. That the Christ had. Ah, you have Let us look at this word. Explaining and demonstrating. What was the power demonstrated? Power, power, power. Money. Raising the dead. Cancer. Cancer. Sickness died. Fire, fire, fire. fire. Many people think that demonstrating is when you start throwing people down and what? That's a lie. It's a lie. It's a lie. There is a demonstration Paul was using the way he was explaining this. One more You see? We have had the word to the dead combo. Now let us see the demonstration. If a spirit come up, you go again. They call that demonstration. Thank you for foolishing everyone. Of course, not everyone. We cannot foolish the Bible. Let me go. Let's open that. What are you demonstrating? Teach you this, sir. So don't skip any word there. Okay. Every word in the Bible is very important. It is a weapon you use. Praise the Lord. Okay, read for Explaining and demonstrating uh -huh. that the Christ had to suffer and rise again from the dead. Uh -huh. Well, whoa. Now, Deborah. 
It is bad to people that are against Christocentric approach of the Bible. It's bad. Why was asking you? Why was Paul demonstrating? He was demonstrating that the Christ had to suffer and rise again from the dead. So have you demonstrated that? We were with the Apostle Johnson. Okay. I was demonstrating with him that the Christ had to suffer according to the scripture by the rise of his. And that's what it was demonstrated. Let me unboy We have had the word. Now time for prophetic. I see a car. I see a man. I see a woman who gets him back. I see people I was very disappointed in this man. He must be liberating up to today. He doesn't know what he lost. Demonstration is when they give you the Bible and you start to prove that the Lord Moses you prove that the Christ who is there is the Jesus. You go past by past. You see this Jesus Christ. You see this just demonstrate. Not prove. That's, that's, please. Can you say that it's mad in the can you say this again? Yeah, what is your name? Explaining and demonstrating uh -huh. that the Christ had to suffer. The Christ had to suffer. Christo, you know, born born. Okay, let me ask you a question. How do you demonstrate that the Christ had to suffer? How do you demonstrate that? Hey? Hey? You talk about the incarnation. That God is above everything. He suffered himself to be born with men. He put on sin. He died. He was buried. On the third day, he rose again. What are you demonstrating there? That the Christ had to suffer. Those are the little topics you are talking about. The incarnation. Sin. Death. Bad. Fall. It is heavy. You are sweating. You are not sweating the vision. You are talking about Moses. Now we try to cover up that. Uh, now I'm preaching. Now uh, brother Sandra, what can I need that? Man of God. Human being. What's wrong with you? Oh, you know, Zimuchi. Uh, what is wrong with you? Uh, what is wrong with you? 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 Is the Bible about that? Bible is what you are going to do. No, you is it? Can you remember to your Bible? It may seem that flash up and you buy it. What are things that we can't offer? My Bible is. Well, what are things you buy? We are going to buy for you. You read it in your Bible. She so many are going to buy for you. What is demonstration? What is such a thing? Demonstration. What is that? Is when you prove that Christ had to suffer. No, no, no. I can't take Christ. I don't want to rise again. According to Genesis to Malachi. That's what God demonstrates. Ah, me, nah. Eh, brother, that is not easy. Oh, look at me. Just a chance. The Holy Spirit must give you utterance. Oh, my God, you find out who are you? Don't use your carbohydrate energy to attempt to do that. Don't use some magic or magic to go 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 get a bowl of chocolate. Oh, you will fall. Oh, you are going to go. Hmm. It's not easy. Sit down. Yeah. Can. Huh? And he said, say it again. Explaining and demonstrating uh -huh. that the Christ had to suffer uh -huh. and raise again from the dead, and saying, "Now yes. you see that uh -huh. that this Jesus whom I preach to you is the Christ." Have you seen how Paul may teach you as he handled the scriptures? Of course, not with his legalistic mind. Remember, Paul lost his mind. He got Christ his mind. The so cannot say that. No, so cannot say that. So is very legalistic. Paul, the apostle, very different. What? Can you read for me that in Uganda? Eh? Eh? 
Nabi kulanga ateke izanti Aha Kristo chamguani la kukubonya abonyeze wa Aha No kusuki la muba fa Who has said those words? Ani ayo gini gabe Apart from Paul Kukuja kwa Paul Didn't Jesus say those words? Yes, they are okay Eh? Yes Didn't Peter say those words? Yes, they are okay Paulo is telling you the same thing akuka bechi tu chechimo ayisinda mochiraba okay kale sala dage ngali kula ngategeza anti kristo chamgwanira okubonya abonyezewa nokuzukira mu bafu era era anti oyo yesu ze gwemba bulira ye kristo those that's how the apostles do you know any preacher today? Who is preaching right now? Komani yo mo mo buri se no raida buri na bato. No, you did not know. Not for me, first pull me out. Ah, they must have been busy. Because they don't like me. They want to come. Yeah, yeah. Because they are facing challenges. They have stopped sleeping even. But they can't even pray back. There is a man people used to. To praise our Lord in Nigeria. And many many people thought this man teaches deep Christian. But in the conclusion, we not we found out that the man is building his empire. In fact, he's using Christ to demonstrate a very different thing. When you tell him to preach cross, eh? Start to stand. They even don't know what this message is all about. When you're teaching about sin, you can cry when you listen to the other people. But people, they are, that Christians listen to him. That man is a Bible scholar. Paul is not a Bible scholar. He's saying, I don't preach with human wisdom. Least the cross of Christ may be emptied of its power. When you scold on it, you are emptying the message of the cross. You cannot use human power and strength and human wisdom to talk about Christ. And I was telling people, but what people used to think, what? I left them. How many seasons does he have about him? I last saw him make his quarter to Chibi. Okay, about incarnation. Kali is quarter to Abaru. Okay, okay, about his quarter. Kali is quarter to his quarter. Okay, Kali about what? Kali is quarter to Kuziki. What? Okay, about sound proper proper by going to be. Kali is sound proper. You guys are saying we by interpretation. We are not competing. Let us go there. Let where the Bible is loud, let us be loud. When it is silent, that's very wise. Can you say that again? Nami kulanga teke izanti, Kristo chamguanira, okubonya abonyezewa, no kusukira mwafu. Era? Era anti oyo yesu zegwe mbabulira ya Kristo. That's not easy. Echo si chamu. Now, what proves that Jesus is the Christ? Church kaka santi Yesu yu Christ. Tari fasa skit yu naima. Soko chibuze mbiru anawa. Church kaka santi. No, answer me. Ask, 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 ask. Mumbate mbola, umusake yu wanga, umusake yu wanga, tonda mbate mbola. Tobule, tobule, pako mbukeke, mbuze mbola mbola. Mugabe. What proves that Jesus is the Christ? Yesu yu Christ. Eh? What proves it? Because Paul is saying, This Jesus I am preaching to you is the Christ. Remember, Genesis to Malachi, they believe the Christ will come. Now, the apostles say, This Jesus is that Christ. Now, how does Jesus prove us a Christ? By the message of the cross. Yeah, they were there. Balo. Then Jesus is talking about. Yes, we don't get up. He died. Yeah, fine. In fact, that's what they said. A virgin shall conceive a son. Very conceive. He got back a son. This son is called Jesus. Okay. He shall die for us. He died. Was buried. He rose again. He ascended. Exalted. He's a power. He's a power. Is the Christ that Moses talked about? 
the preacher, the prophet. Oh man, and they you preach, you preach, you preach. And they end up eating all the big stones. So I ask, as you say, which one was it? <laughs> what proves eh, that Jesus is the Christ? <laughs> hey, it is the message of the cross. That's why that message eh, is the foundation of the church. Who do you believe? I'm not telling you. Before you talk about Christ, I know you don't know Christ. My Christ don't mind. Who do you believe? You believe in Jesus. Why do you believe in him? Because he died, was buried, resurrected. According to how the Christ would suffer. Why do you believe in him? 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 Now for you, you thought, how do you prove that Jesus is the Christ? That's how you get those guys. Eh? Right, right, right now. Now, ask this man. Sir, who is Jesus? Who is Jesus? Yes, you're here. This is my Talk about the Christ. You get a good Christ. If you don't know the message of the cross, what you want to talk about? I don't prove that Jesus is the Christ. Yes, his name is called Jesus the Christ. Yes, his name is called Jesus the Christ. Now, the apostles would prove this man who killed, who whom you spat upon, whom you killed, whom you betrayed and gave to the Gentiles. This man, God has made both Lord and King, and his grave is empty. Now, this is what the world is. It is the truth Jesus died and rose again. But the Pharisees don't believe that this Jesus who died and rose again is the other Christ that the prophets are talking about. For them they believe there is another Christ that is coming. You see that Christ that is coming. It is another Jesus that the, the religions are preaching right now. Yes, we are ready to go and go. That's how the apostate church started. They don't believe that this Jesus who died and rose again is the Christ. You are going to see, you are going to see. Can you read that again and continue? They are what you are going to do. Now, we are going to say, Christ is the Christ who is the Christ. Aha. Aha. No, we are going to say, Aha. And we are going to say, Aha. We are going to say, Christ. Those are what we are going to say. Oh yes, we are going to We are going to That's what you are talking about. How did he preach you? Ya bulira cha Yesu yo. Baba, there is a Jesus who was preached. Why are you square ya bulira? Ha? So, ya bu ya bulira nga Adam. Oh yes, we are going to bulira. This Jesus I preached. Ya ya bulira nga cha. How did he preach him? How? In First Corinthians 15, he gives us a clue of how we preach. Which we all know. Yes. You don't know that? Can you give it to me? 15, 2, 3, 4. Luganda. Okay, start from verse 1. Kale Matekeza, Abu Luganda. Enjiri jenna babu ulira Era jemu awewa Era jemu ino elera mu So waloche ya liya abu ulira There is what he used to preach Waloche ya liya abu ulira Habiko da? Mochifunye Aha Era jemu loko kera mu So the chika wa babu loko li The watch is Can they not sing the liya kumi pili It's older than 2,000 years Siti pia It is not new Malikira wa gamba wa chuto wa loko li kupia wa kato Stop telling people that Oh, wa loko li kato wa sing the liya kumi pili It is well older than 2,000 years Sine baluwa sine liya kumi pili Wabula nga mwakiriza wele 
What is that? Chichecho. Continue. Kubanga nasoka o kubawa mwe. Erache nawewa. Why what he abawa? He gave them something. Just yeah. like he received it. Chicho. What is that? Nga Christo ya fa. Already be ya fe. Aha. Gave ya wa nikiwa. Baby okay. Read a go. Wait. Read a go. I not ya wait at the kuchilaba. Christo ya fa. Already be ya fe. Yes, Eh? 
kwabo banji abachali abalamu kusaka kano naye abamu bebaka Fagoda yes koti na aloka alabikira yakobo aha na aloka alabikira abatume bonna that's it
Right. That's why we call that chapter the resurrection chapter. That's why we call it so. With these following reasons. The moment you stand and say, I am called Apostle Solomon. Do you know what you are saying? You can explain and elaborate and detail Jesus. You have made a mistake if you have lied to us that you saw him. Otherwise, Otherwise don't you. call yourself an apostle. Be careful. Be careful. Because when he could appear to you, he could sit into you, and when he's into you, you could prove that he is the Christ. Without going to the university. Paul never went back to Gamelio to study. No, he dropped what he had studied from Gamelio. And then he said, that I may know him, and the power of his resurrection, and the fellowship of his suffering. He performed that to his day. That was after. 35 years. He really wanted to know more. But he had dropped the scholastic views of what? Amen? Have you seen that? So, we, when you talk like that, you are reason. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. So, go back, go back. We are on 17. Verse 4. There is something I need to see. Go back to the Okay. Nabikula nga take is anti. Uh-huh. Christo Chamguani la Okuanya when you say what? Uh-huh. No Kuzuki and Bakfu. Uh-huh. Eranti or yes, who is a great Babulia, a Christo. I have explained that. It's your children. Uh-huh. Five. Abamu Kubo, okay, never kills her. Abamu Kubo, never Polaji, never kills her. Aha, never got any power, never Polaji. Never Polaji, I will come, never got any power. Aha, let's see ya. Ah, never your nanny, a big end is a Hivina Chinene. Ah, never Chala, Abakuru, Sibatono. Plus elderly women, never Chala, Abakuru. Sibatono. Sibatono? Hey, they were not few. Women, we are always. Apostles. And it started with Jesus. So you cannot underlook women in apostolic work. In fact, they work harder than what you see. They are silent workers. That's why in the kingdom of God, I think they may get the better reward. Yes. Yes. Wow. Don't get offended by that. People like sitting on women. Eh? You come and talk and talk and talk. Then you, you don't talk about the women who are behind what you are doing. But look at the apostles. They are so evident. Yes. Especially apostles. The Peter used to sit on some women. You don't know that. But I know Peter some night in jail. You see that? No, Stop underlooking women. No, you tell your neighbor. Stop underlooking women. Don't think women are there to be used. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to go to the same one. I'm not going to go to the same one. I'm not going to go to the same one. I'm not going to go to the same one. When a woman stands for God's work, it cannot fail. A man can betray. A man. Do you know many men have betrayed us? Of course, when a woman betrays you, you just know she's a Satan incarnate. If a woman, if a woman Women, Abakazi, they are good, Baruchi. Continue, fine, in a broken town. Nay, Abayudaya, ah, Bewakwa, Tiwa, Wuja, 
Nebatuala abantu abavi abo mwa kopi baba kunga nisa abavi baba kuatwa ohuja nebatuala abantu abavi abantu abavi abo mwa kopi abo mwa kopi neba kunga nisa abantu neba kunga nisa abantu neba sasa maza echibuka neba sasa maza echibuka orel baba kwa 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 So nili chie soro sasa mazeji Kwanji Njili chie soro Kuleta wa sajia ukutula kuchi Ata mi ujituare Nwara ufele Nwara wa ustuare Njili chie Leta Aka sasa mazo Aba tuneba sasa Which one? My friend, the sufferings of Christ. When I was a Christian, I was growing up before. Yes, sir. Those who come to me, our Papa will see you. That gospel can paralyze them. Yes, it is all about salvation. Can you read it again? The word so. The verse is Samaza. The verse is Samaza. It's Luke. Aha. The verse is Giza. The number is Yasoni. Aha. Nebaka la ukubali tamu masoka abantu. Nebaka la ukubali tamu maji. Masoka abantu. Kwa sababu kaza mukamani kwa sababu. You know, you know their habits. Eh? Okay, continue. Six. Beba chama la ba. Ah? Neba walula ya sioni. Na bolunganda abamu ukubatu alamu masoka abakulu. Abo mchibuka. Ma abakulu ya chuka kuzamba man. You know those are overseers. Beba la bidiza. Yes. Eh? Aha. Gabo kera, gabo kera na wakulunti. Gabo kera na wakulunti. Bano abafuni ka ensi. Bano abafuni ka eliyalo. Bano ne wano. Bano ne wano. Oh yeah, 
for 18, you go up to 20 to Uganda. So that people know where we came from, so right? So I want to take it over to the Omoyo kwa mkama kuli kunze Kumanga ya afka kwa amafta Okuhuli ya abafu Evi gambo evi nunji Antumye okutende la abanyaki okutewa No kuzibula abazibiba maso Okuvata ababetetewa You see that? Continue Okutende la omaka kwa mkama Ogwa kiliziwa You see that? Continue Na vika kwa ekitabo Na kwa vika pesa Na chikiza omweleza Na chikiza omweleza Give me to that Natula, natula. Aha, abantu wana abali mukunga niyo. Hey, ni mamo simba ko amas. Ah, tute. Na basa jamu jamu ni damu. Ni basi ni mukunga kasi. Bado mimi watu la watu wangu diakama. I thought when you see people take your eyes off. Okay. Aha. Na tanula ukubwa gambanti. E amas o gamu tunuli rangi na na tanula. Wapa ato o o tunuli na imedi do o tunuli na tu. You're looking at the ones standing or the ones who are pulled up. Bamu tunuli na. Natanula ukubwa gambanti. Lero ebya wandi kwa bino bito kiri demo matuka mwe. Can you say that four times? Lero ebya wandi kwa bino bito kiri demo matuka mwe. Can you say that again? Lero ebya wandi kwa bino bito kiri demo matuka mwe. Don't get that. Lero ebya wandi kwa bino bito kiri demo matuka mwe. Who is that one speaking? Anyway, you get that. Can you say that again? Lero ebya wandi kwa bino bito kiri demo matuka mwe. Now. That's where he was. I will never die. Now I want to ask a question. As scriptures going to be fulfilled? If you want to go again, now we're talking it wisdom now. We are saying that. Only the Eh? Eh? These were two thousand years back. Two thousand years back. He's saying it. Eh? This is. Has been fulfilled today. Today. Now, I want to ask a question. So, as scriptures fulfilled, all they are fulfilled. I want you to answer me, Christian. Are they fulfilled or they are fulfilled? Okay. If they were fulfilled, why do you quote them? Why do you want them to fulfill producing children? Why do you want them to fulfill the agendas of men? Jesus and the scriptures fulfill. Then why do you want them to fulfill something yet someone was fulfilled? Because you want them and you say, Ah, the Bible says, and it tells me that that to God is the one in Aruba Goliath. The way that that to God is in Aruba Goliath. Your poverty is at that. Your sickness is at that. You know what you are saying? That the scriptures are going to be fulfilled when your poverty is at that. Yet, they are not going to be fulfilled. They were fulfilled. Why do you fulfill now? Something that was fulfilled as a God. Which kind of Bible interpretation are you giving us? <laughs> Ask someone. Brother, haven't you been reading scripture that something is fulfilled in your life? It's very different. It's very different. It's very different. It's very different. You have been reading your mind. Even if you look at that side. You have been quoting scripture that something comes to pass in your life. Yes, 2,000 years ago, the scriptures were fulfilled. What is going to be fulfilled now that was not fulfilled today? Now you tell me, you are telling us, the Bible is about us. Why do you quote the psalm of David? To satisfy your hunger for money. Because you are having enemies. Ah, Mukama, Anaranangetarosange. 
That was his mission. But why not? He will, he will save us from their sin. We all have different missions. All of us have different missions. But why is it that they are not like Jesus' mission? No, we want to be different. Isaiah 61. So let me hear from three people, then I continue. 